In a forgotten corner of the city where the cobblestone roads meandered into desolate paths, stood a house that whispered tales of mystery and intrigue. This was the home of Eugenia, an old woman who carried an air of solitude and bore a dark reputation. Her peculiar ways and enigmatic past were the subjects of hushed conversations, the kind that sent a shiver down one's spine. As the moon claimed the night, a peculiar event unfurled over the city. A shroud of shadows draped Eugenia's house and a howling wind erupted from its core like a beast breaking free from its chains. Fueled by courage, the neighbors convened, resolving to venture into the heart of the enigma that was Eugenia's house. Upon entering the eerie dwelling, the doors slammed shut with a thunderous crash. An unsettling laughter echoed through the air and the shadows began to dance on the walls, contorting into grotesque shapes. A chilling realization dawned upon the neighbors. They were ensnared in the clutches of a malevolent force and escape was the only recourse. However, their path to freedom was soon obstructed by Eugenia herself, her face split into a wicked grin. The rumors were true, Eugenia was a witch luring unsuspecting souls into her abode to claim their life force. The neighbors had to confront this malevolent presence to survive. Their battle against the witch was an arduous one. Yet, bound by a shared resolve and fueled by faith, they stood strong against the darkness. As the last chant echoed through the haunted halls, the house of Eugenia erupted into flames, vanishing into the abyss of the night. Emerging from the smoldering ruins, the neighbors were shaken but triumphant. They had faced the embodiment of evil and lived to tell the tale. The house of Eugenia was left as a desolate reminder of the dark witch and the night of horror. No soul dared to venture near for fear of awakening the defeated evil. In the end, their chilling encounter with the supernatural served as a stern reminder of the power of unity and courage in the face of darkness. It taught them that often it is not the monsters that lurk in the shadows that we should fear, but the ones that reside within us. And it is only when we confront these inner demons that we truly discover the depth of our courage and the strength of our spirit.